I got some good news and I got some bad news. I got some bad news about good news if you feel what I'm saying. I've listened to it a total of 10 times. My friend the other night, she asked me, she was like, oh, it's that good? You listened to it 10 times, it's that good? And I was like, no, I was trying to like it. Now, something is off when you gotta force yourself to like a body of work. Blah, 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 la, la, la. If you wanna leave, then bye, bye, bye. She tried it with that Don't Rock Me to Sleep record. She tried it. What in the Rebecca Black is going on here? But I get it. I really don't believe Megan has a lot of control over what's going on with her music right now. You know what I mean? Sure, she writes her bars, but I feel like that's the most that they give her. She's just being put through this, you know, machine. And I feel like there's so many um, people that have hands just on her. You know what I mean? I feel that something in my spirit is telling me this is not, it's not her. So we're not going to make her feel bad about that. It's not Megan's fault that she doesn't know that Mary had a little lamb. Maybe where Megan's from, Mary had a little dog or a little kitty cat, or a little bald-headed brother named Bart. It is not Megan's fault, and we're not gonna hold that against her, are we? No, we are not. You sing, Megan, whatever it is that is in you to sing. Blah, 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 la, la, la. If you wanna, if you know where that's from, put it in the comments below if you know where that's from. I can my cash up me some money next year. Listen, it's not her fault. I really blame the label. If I hear, shut the fuck up, on a, on a track, with Megan again, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I really want her with, with, with different producers. I'm, I'm tired of that, that Juicy J Project Pat stuff. I mean, the sample's cool, but is it really a sample if you just rip the whole beat? Like, if you don't switch it up a little bit, like, add some flair to it, put some color on it, it's just, I wasn't, I mean, the only good sample that was, I was like, oh, okay, was that Jasmine Sullivan Circles. And so, speaking of circles, speaking of the album, Let's just get into some of the songs, you know what I mean? Okay, shots fired, Biggie, cool. You know, I get it. She had to do it. Don't like it. I don't know if it's just me, I just feel like she should have did the hit em up instrumental. Not the who shot you, because we know who shot you. You know who shot you. Everybody know. He know. We know. I just feel like that was a little, uh, a little corny. Circles, one of my fave tracks. I really feel like it could be a single. The sample, bomb, round and round. Shout out to Jasmine Sullivan. Another song that she got, that new song that she just put out. We'll talk about that in a minute. People don't like Cry Baby. I don't understand what the what is going on. I like Cry Baby. I feel like that's one of her. I feel like that's one of the best beats. Maybe because I like that hard hitting. You know, I like. Come on, man. I don't like how the baby kind of started the song. It was kind of like, okay, where are you going with it? Like, catch the beat. Okay, I, he, was, he was okay, cool. But listen, by the time you finish this album. One thing you will know is Megan likes to have sex, okay? She likes to get down and dirty right on, okay? On the top, you want it on the tire, you want it on the bed, you want it on the floor, okay? What's your fantasy to see? I think one of the lines she said, uh, beat it up till, till it's red, so woo. Wow. Do it on the tip, do it on the tip. My favorite part about this song is JT's part. Um, I was cool on, um, I was cool on Young Miami. I'm cool on her part. When JT came through with that little whisper, little flow, I was like, oh, JT. And stop saying JT is ugly. Who, who, what is all that about? What is all that about? We'll talk about that. We'll talk about that in a minute too. So Sugar Baby. Now Sugar Baby is where it kind of took me to mixtape. You know what I mean? Because this album, it, it, it has a, a big mixtape energy for me. The songs are not cohesive. When you just kind of flow over a beat and, and a sample, is it really a sample if you just rip the whole beat without, you know, adding something different to it, switching it up, slowing it down? I don't know, putting some color in it. I, eh, I'm okay on Sugar Baby. Eh, it's not really my fave. It's okay. Freaky Girls is cool. I feel like that can be a single. You know what I mean? Shout out to Sizzle on the track. I feel like she did her thing on that. Body yadi 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 Big budget Meg, okay? Because the video is what saved it for me. So you wanna know my favorite part about body? My favorite part is when she's saying, you can't play with me like a touch me not. Like a touch me. Who told her about touch me nots though? I love it. I love it. 
it. I really want her to be released from the shackles of Juicy J and, and all of them. Please, like, please let her work with somebody else, you know? And possibly a writer. Possibly. I know she writes. I know she writes down. But it wouldn't be that bad just to, you know, have a little help, you know, for the hooks. She can, you can do the verse. For the hooks in the chorus, the, the hooks in the chorus need work. You know what I mean? Um, cause adi 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 adi, that ain't that's not gonna, <laughs> that ain't hitting. Sexual intercourse. I like that song. You know what I mean? I feel like they went in the studio and we they was just like, look, we just gonna throw a whole bunch of stuff against the board and whatever sticks. Okay, we need a pop record. Okay, we need a little we need a little island flair. Okay, cause that's what's popping now. Uh, okay, we definitely need the booty shaking songs. We're going to have that up in there. Um, you know, we got to have a little slow jam. All right, that's the outside song. Um, and and, and, and it, that's just going to be what it is. And we're going to title that good news. Don't do Megan like that. She deserves much more. And you just throwing ideas out. You know what I mean? But I like it. I really like inter Intercourse. Megan actually sounds like the feature. Um, it doesn't sound like her song. But I'm okay with that. So go crazy. Love go crazy. Big Sean did his thing. Two Chains, uh, I'm not the biggest Two Chains. Like, I'm not a fan of his rap. Two Chains is like whatever to me. I think Go Crazy should be a single. Probably not, cause it's like feature heavy. I think the, the idea now is kind of just to show her. How, let's have a Megan song. You know what I mean? Just, just Meg, and she carry a song all the way to number one, um, by herself. So outside with the Michelet, something in your heart, something. I like that song. I really, really do. I like that song. And, you know, I like what she's basically saying. She's like, look, I'm going to shake this ass and I'm going to show this body because that's what they want to see. That's what they want from me. You know what I mean? And that's what keep me paid. So y'all could be mad. <laughs> you could be mad about it. But that's what I'm going to do. And we outside. And after that, you got Savage. Of course, you got to throw that in there because I got Beyonce in there. We got to put that on there. <laughs> we got to put that on there, okay? That's that's like 80% of, of the streams. I really feel like they just should have closed it out with Outside. That, that was, I feel like that was a nice button on the whole album. Overall, uh, the album is, 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 uh, <laughs> she could do better. She could do better. Like I said, we're not going to hold it against her. I blame the label. And I know she's just trying to fulfill her obligations to 1501. I really feel like when she gets released, it's 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 up from there. It's gonna be up from there. It's cool for what it was, but it wasn't all that. If you know what that's from, put it in the comments below. If you know what it's from, put it in the comments below. It's from the same movie. Okay. Did y'all like the album? What's your favorite songs? What should be the next single? Drop down in the comments below. Let me know. If you like this video, click the thumbs up. Subscribe. Shout out to all the new subscribers. I see y'all. Welcome to the circus, okay, where we do clownery. And when you do clownery, the clown comes back to bite. Um, it just ain't came yet, but I'm pretty sure he's on the way. So anyway, I'll holla at y'all in the next one. Peace.